Hey y'all, it's Justice, and obviously I am starting a lash business, as you can see, because you clicked on the video. But so far, I have separated them, like I've been opening up the packages, and these are the ones that have been good that I've opened. These are like a few dings, and let me see like a little few dings and stuff like that i probably still use them but i just like separating them to see if i want to use them and then these are like bro you, you can right oops don't listen to the background but like you see how this one like this one was like are you joking like bro it's all the way smashed like what but okay maybe it can be fixed or salvaged or something i hope okay so now i put the lash in there and i actually i like the way this look on camera because it's like all sparkly and well, i can't anyways it's all sparkly but i kind of feel like it's like away from the lash Instead of like if you have this one, you open this one up, you can really see the lash. So, I don't know if I'm going to do the pimp. I didn't waste that much money on it. It was like $3. Okay, so these are the 25mm lashes. I don't really wear them, but I know I have my dramatic sisters do. So, I got to appeal to everybody. Um... It didn't make too much of a difference. I actually like them better with the glitter than without the glitter. So, I don't know. Hey, y'all. Uh, excuse my voice. I am tired. But I do. I did say I was going to keep y'all informed on the whole process and everything. So, as of right now, I've started boxing. My lashes, baby. Yeah, so we have this one, which I have named Center. If y'all want help naming y'all stuff, don't ask me because I had a hard time. I just sat there and just kept writing down names that came to mind until I found enough names that I liked that I could use. So these are Center. Y'all see, I did not use the pink paper because it was taken away from my, like, lashes to me. This is Rule Bender. Um, these are Hellraiser. And this one. Saint. They so sanctified. Then I have this one. I'm just going to show y'all. So, sorry, switch your hands. Bear with me, baby. Bear with me. So how I'm boxing them is obviously I try to get that out the way and just put it in there, try to make sure that's straight and boom, you have what I need baby. Okay. I'm going to show y'all how I make my labels real quick because it's like 2.35 a.m. and I am tired. So, I went to Wally World, went to Walmart and bought this uh, label maker. And it came with uh, some labels, but they're, they're the white paper and I did not want that look. I just feel like that would not be me and it would be a little messy looking. So I bought the refillable cartridge, but I bought the clear labels um, and put them in here. So I guess I'll show you. All right, cut it on. This is when I was making the last ones. So we'll do this backspace, backspace, backspace. Um, these are called. These are the. 25 mm denture space 
Well, I think this is gonna be. Oh, I know what I'm doing wrong. Okay, I do this almost every time. Don't pay me no mind. I just bought this thing a day, okay? So you have to literally change the font and put it as a lowercase d a d. Where is it? Where is it? I'm trying to look through the phone and find it. Sorry, y'all. And I'm tired, bro. Like your brain will literally move like in the slowest capacity, like when you tired. And I type all day, so I, how do I not know where the letters and what they look like? Ah, oh, I did the thing again. But anyways, maybe y'all won't be working at two, three o'clock in the morning, but I am. Danger zone. Make sure you spell it right. Don't wanna. Oh, girl, janky. Okay, but make sure you spell it right. And you don't wanna be looking retarded, like printing out the wrong labels. But anyways, you get it. You make sure this is what you want. It prints and it prints from the side. Okay. Cut it. Um, and you have your label OMG I like to print multiple and just go ahead and have them all printed I also cut them down a little bit because I feel like that's just too much extra and as you can see that's not going to fit on this like triangle my, my guy like why are you so mad at me what did I do okay Back to what I was saying. That ain't gonna fit right. It's gonna be hanging all over. So I'm gonna take my scissors and cut it down. Okay, so I have them cut down to like a meter size. And I actually made too many, but whatever. Yeah, you have your like little lashes. Oh my gosh. And then you just take your case. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and you just put them in the case. Oh my gosh. Boom. 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 Okay. Just happened that I got to the last little set that I'm going to do. Because baby, I'm fat. And I still got more to do. Like just more stuff to do. But... Anyways, seventeen dollars at Walmart. Clear ones was like two dollars and thirty cents or something like that. Under twenty five dollars, you can make your own labels. Stop hearing other people that. Now the labels are going on the outside of the box for your name. I haven't really gotten to how I'm gonna make my own yet on that. So I paid someone, but eventually I do want to make my own because, yeah. Hey y'all. So back with the next step. Now, I finally got my labels from my guy who printed my labels. And it says Lashed by Lay Amour. And I spent like $30 and he printed me like, and they like rolls. So he had this big thing and it was like, yeah, 500 he said. He said. But anyways, so I... We'll probably change the box. I'm not going to really change my colors. But I'm going to change my box. Because remember I told you I didn't like the box people. But So you really can see it. But you can't see it. Anyways I did that. And then I have this sheet of diamonds. I bought at Walmart for like 2 $3. You can just like pick one off at a time. And so I've been putting those on my boxes. And so these are the same ones. Oh, girl, this is how I'm packaging them. So, I got my little baggies from Dollar Tree. And I thought they were going to be way bigger. But they just like the same exact size. But it's cool. I'm figuring it out. And I put them in here with this little hand homemade confetti. That's my bag of confetti I made. I just got 
different color papers. I use tissue paper. I recommend using regular paper because tissue paper did not go through the shredder that well if you're going to shred it. And definitely don't try to do hole punches because I ate hours. That's all the hole punches I got. So, yeah. Tissue paper ain't it. But, um, anyways, put it through the shredder, white, gold, and like a light pink. Try to get it close to my name as possible. So that it all just kind of went with the same color scheme. Put it in the shredder. Took me one of these little, you know, baggies. Put the box in there with the confetti. And boom. And I put my business card in there. If y'all haven't seen my business card. Color coordinating. These are faint. So all of Saint, when I put them in these bags so that I know what they are, and I fold them up all nice, you can see it's like all folded and everything, but from this side, you can see my name, confetti. From this side, you can see confetti. And post that lash by like more. But, <clears throat> so that you know what they are, because if you're going to package them, like I'm about to package them and go and sell them out and about, then you're going to want to have a color coordinated system to know which one you're getting without having to constantly open up your boxes and your bags. And this is that system. So these are like just the little color coding labels that you get and you do, you know, when you're in school, you do it. And I just went to that, that aisle all the school supplies and stuff and so i just took them and this is going to be sane i think this is hellraiser center angel wing dang no not danger zone but um i don't know y'all i can't keep going with them <laughs> but i have them all written down on which one is which and so while i'm doing all of my saint they're gonna have the boom Good gold and then when I do all those say hell raises to have all the blue and so yeah bam now I can patch it package them and get them ready to go out and sell them tomorrow so we can sell out and uh, what else did I need to tell y'all I was gonna try to do like a little you know sweet little message you're loved and love yourself is what this one says but they were not looking cute it was kind of looking tacky and i don't want to take away from the way my stuff is looking i really like organized colors on i was gonna be kind of neat okay y'all i want to show y'all how i'm packaging it so let's take it all out start off with the empty clear bag i put my box in here. Mind you, I did do the box myself, just in case. Put my label, put my diamond, put my label. These the hell raises. And remember I told y'all I color coordinate everything, color coordinate everything so I keep up with it. So I have this. And this is just my business card. Slide that in the back. Okay. I take about three fingers full of confetti. And I mean, I have plenty of confetti, so I mean, it's lasting. Anyways, if I can get it, that's right. Okay. I put a little bit on the top. And I put a little bit on the back. Okay. So now it looks, you know, like so. And then I take it. I bunch it up at the back really tight and the one that is this right there all right so it's bunched up okay so remember it's bunched up at the back because that's the front because that's where my name is okay Tuck these two sides down, flip that flap over, flip this one over that one, and tape it really good across. 
and now it's packaged. I think I'm going to show y'all more just so y'all know. Uh, but then also, remember I told y'all I have these to color coordinate. Pink is Hellraiser. These are Hellraiser that I'm doing. So I'm going to take a pink one right there where that little, you see how I folded it over to get it to the lace flat? I just put um, that on there. So I know this is Hellraiser. So yeah, so this is it. This is my package I'm going to hand out, you know. Place the card in there with some baby or whatever. And then I told y'all I'm keeping up with them. So this is the bag full of Hellraiser. I made another label with Hellraiser. Put the pink so I know that's the Hellraiser color. And I put that in there. So that's Hellraiser. And I'm going to start on Angel Wings. So I didn't have enough of these for my Danger Zone one. So I just made one this thing comes with a lot of symbols you can use so I, I just showed this one which i think means danger if not oh well it's gonna mean danger today and so i have my danger zone okay so if you're gonna be selling them like in public and you might have a big crowd so you're not gonna want to really have to go in and out these bags to show people what it look like blah 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 so i am going to make a display where they can't take my stuff they can't you know you might be looking at a lot of people you don't want nobody grabbing your stuff so i'm putting this paper down the size because i just need something hard to put in here for my display but i took a piece of printer paper and you stack it in there. Then I have one of each one. Uh, it was working, but it was moving around in the bag, and I don't want it to do this. So now I have decided that I'm going to tape it down. So now you see they on there, they ain't going nowhere. We good to go. We good. We, we good. I think I'm gonna still. No, it's too big. I'm doing too much. So my paper, my bag has the side to say description. You see, I'm gonna flip it on the other side so it's not messing with the people what they can view. And I think I just made me a good story. I want to see, okay, well, which ones you want, sis? Which ones do you want, sis? But yeah, that's everything. And as you can see, I have everything. I have my angel wings, center, danger from rule bender, hellraiser, saint. And I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. This is my extra boxes. I'm going to put them in a bag. And... I'm good to go. I will make more videos. If y'all need to know anything else, let me know. If you have any questions about anything else, let me know. My little setup, too, in case y'all are just trying to YouTube stuff. White cardboard um, thingy from Dollar Tree. You know that you do, like, projects. I got two of them. One here, one for the back. Bam. You have a white setup, white station. Okay? Yeah, that's everything. Thank y'all for watching. And, um support and i'm gonna y'all like comment subscribe add me on instagram facebook whatever you are on and i'm gonna leave everything in the comment description and also um if you want to purchase then i'll have that in the comment section as well but thank y'all for watching y'all have a good day